Hey there guys, Gales fans and pals, your buddy John Megacycle here, and another episode of Wall World coming at you. Yeah, last run wasn't the best, it wasn't bad. Uh, we did get another depth scanner, which will tell us anomalies in a cave. We also got, uh, before that I think we got, no, we got the vacuum cleaner last time as well. Yeah, 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 alright, all caught up. We're playing in hard difficulty, you can see here. The fact that you can change it uh, is fine. But I always want to make it clear and upfront. We're doing this on hard mode. We're having a good time. Um, I gave the game like two, three hours, two, three, four hours. I don't remember. On normal before the big 1.08 patch, and now the 1.09 patch, and uh, I liked it. I liked it enough to be like, you know what? I could, I could totally play a bunch of this. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So I, I think we're past the level of experience I have with the game. So everything like, well, I, we're well into new stuff, as far as I know. Uh, I don't know if there's like a mammoth tank for a weapon or something. Holy crap, that would be amazing. Note to self, message developer. Please beg for robo spider that is actually a mammoth tank. It's just cosplaying as a spider. It is actually a mammoth tank. Thanks, love you, bye. <laughs> So we got the better vacuum thing, so that hopefully that means a little less ferrying stuff around. Uh, if we have to, it's not that big of a deal, but... Oh, I missed my seismic generator already. Aw, oh, the thing that does the thing. I miss it. We're definitely clearing a lot more minerals as we're ranking up tech-wise. It's always weird when we start fresh because the game feels really stuttery. Um, and that's not... It's not... I don't think there's an issue. Um, it's just everything is so slow. Uh, just like playing Risk of Rain or something. When you got a good run going and you got some good RNG, then it's like, you died. And now you have to start over and you're like, oh my god, I like playing the Engineer and I'm so slow. Medium, one anomaly. Now, I got an anomaly already. So is there one more anomaly? Or in this cave is one Uno anomaly and that's it? I don't I don't know. I don't know the answer to that question. Just waiting for the combat time to happen so I can shoot somebody in the head. Thanks. Sorry about that, I dropped my water. My lips made a squeaky sound. So from an empirical perspective, we need to understand what that number means, right? It says one anomaly. Did that mean one anomaly was in this cave? It's the anomaly we got. Assuming I don't even know if that was an anomaly. I'm going to guess it is. I'm going to guess it's a non-mineral thing. Okay, there's a weapon here. Which I am going to get, because I am a fiend for the stake launcher. Hmm. Talked about the shotgun like two episodes ago. I honestly thought I hallucinated it. Actually, give me just half of a second here. You're going to hear no audio from the game. It always bothers me when Windows Update happens without me prompting it and it's installing a bunch of stuff. Yeah, that's why it feels jittery to me. Windows Update is high high memory, high CPU, high everything. That's a good sign. I probably have a botnet. Please send help. Um, okay, so we got an anomaly. Uh, I don't know if it's going to disappear. It'll either, you know, okay, so like, let's draw some like conclusions, right? It's either gonna say one anomaly still, even though I got the weapon, or it's gonna say zero because I got the weapon, right? So we're gonna have to understand what that number means. Depending on how it's interpreted, it might mean separate things. So let's just go ahead and grab in. Okay. There's one anomaly in there. It is the weapon cache or the weapon room or something. 
the room is the anomaly, not so much the weapon itself. Maybe that's a better interpretation of that information? Interpretation of the information. Large, one anomaly. Okay. So if I come across literally anything, we got the thing, we can go. That's how I'm gonna understand that. Now, if it's an anomaly that we bring back and we get some technology out of it, you know, like the orbs, the glowing orby thingies, if that counts down one because we've removed it from the map, that also makes sense. We seem to pay attention. So we got one anomaly kicking kicking a boot. You get got. You get got. Thanks. Uh, I probably can't get a mining upgrade, can I? I am three pieces off. Bad boo. <laughs> boo and hiss and bad. Uh, it's fine. It's not an issue. I'm just a big whiny baby. I'm a big whiny baby that wants to be efficient about things, damn it. Uh, I hope I have three items in my purse, or this is gonna- yes, okay, thank goodness. I was like, if this is a total waste, I'm gonna cry. <laughs> we're all good, yeah, we're fine, we're fine. Yeah, this is why I wanted the bigger thrill. Reminds me of a conversation from the whole nine yards. Okay, there's- there is an item. Ad infinitum, this is the item. Uh, about drills, it reminds me of a movie called The Whole Nine Yards. Uh, Matthew Perry, I want to say, and... Gosh, I can't remember his name, or her name, or whatever. can't remember the rest of the actors, but, like, effectively, Matthew Perry is... suckered into some assassin work, but, like, he's a dentist. So he has a patient... No drill. You pull the tooth, we'll still be friends. No drill. Okay, what does it say now? Okay, zero anomalies, which is great. Because at this moment, I'm not going to fart around with this mine anymore. This mine's done. It's cached. I don't care. So that actually saves me a boatload of time. I like that very much. Oh, I missed one. Whoops. The camera zoomed out, and I lost place of stuff. Large one, okay. And as we're doing all this, our mining operation is still going, which I really appreciate. Look at that, another combat, no damage. Salt, no chaser. Straight no chaser. Salt no chaser? How rich do you have to be <laughs> to have a chaser for your salt? <laughs> oh my. Uh, just the implications there just really spun out of control. I want to be angry and I want to carry a salty disposition at all times. However, I also need a chaser because I don't want to feel bad after being jerk-like to someone else. That sounds like a rich person conversation, doesn't it? Uh, my goodness. I can't even imagine. Okay, I'm hoping to find this one anomaly. And then just move on with the cave. Uh, we should get this all back to HQ, though. There's quite a bit sitting here. Oh, uh, right. I guess now that I can hold five more items or whatever, that kind of screws with my brain a little bit, but I stand by what I said. I still want to get this back. <laughs> yes! Yes! Holy crap, it's working. Come on! Yep. 
Gone. Beautiful stuff. 25, 25. Darn near 25 again. Dang it, I was hoping I could kill it fast enough. No anomaly yet. That's okay. I want to say Amelie and not Anomaly. Amelie is a French movie, I believe. And uh, the thing that makes that funny is nothing. No, I'm kidding. <laughs> uh, the thing that makes it funny is that was referenced in Bob's Burgers. I've seen Amelie, like, I don't know, another 15, 20 years ago thing. I've seen Amelie. And uh, there's a there's an episode in Bob's Burgers where Bob and everyone wants to get back at this guy that was pulling comp, like pulling fake meals and stuff. And for, uh, Teddy, I was gonna say Freddy. Freddy is what Mr. Fish order sometimes sometimes calls Teddy. Uh, Teddy's like, let's just switch out his shoes for shoes that are one size too small. Come on, we'll just Amelie the guy. Yep, that's some of the stuff that happens in the movie. <laughs> Just like, not not devastatingly like I'm going to burn your house down, but just enough to screw with somebody. Ah, oh, the breaker generator's back now that I invested in the friggin' bomb. That kind of makes me feel a little sad, but whatever. It's fine. Hopefully we'll be blessed with the resource generator, and it'll be fine. Day 11. Bored. Keep snacking out of boredom. I wiped out a three-week supply in three days. Holy crap. Dude, catch up on sleep. Write a memoir. Learn a trick with your hands or something like, like do learn how to do that. I learned how to do that really early. I got my game on real, real early in life. This actually is not the direction I wanted to go, but it's the direction we're going. So that's a thing. I can't see anything. One small. Okay. Yeah, I think we're not at the right tech level to be up here. Thank you. That's exactly what I wanted to have happen. I know, I know, it's weird. Inside this madness is some sort of a method. And we're just gonna take the damage. Okay. Good stuff, and now we double back again. Now we'll actually take real damage this time. Oh, there's something in the way. Oh, come on! No! I took so much unnecessary damage for no reason at all. That makes me sad. Okay, we have to do one more pass. Because I'm using the shotgun, right? I can't, I can't uh, outrange them. Yeah, now... Oh, well, this is perfect. Perfect, uh... Not really... What I mean. Oh, come on! Oh, I thought that was still on recharge. Whoops. Well, you live, you learn, you screw up like I did. And that's how that works. You see how long this is taking for me to mine, even though this is already, like, pre-mined? Ugh. Yeah, we went the wrong way. Uh, I'd like to clear this out if I can. Nope, time-wise, I think this is going to be a waste. I'm going to grab a handful of these materials, though. So I can upgrade whatever the next tier of whatever I want. Uh, probably the drill. Wait a minute, do I not have the materials to upgrade the drill? I thought I would now. Um, let's see here. Nope, I need greens. This is the next stack. This is the next tier, but I'm missing this guy. Alright, yeah, we're gonna go. 
Uh, so up, down, no, 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 no. Clear the biome we're in, down, up. That's how that should go. Uh, what the heck is that? Well, whatever. Graphical glitch, probably. Probably? Probably. Alright, uh, machine gun? Oh, we even decided what kind of weapon we we're gonna use, did we? Uh, machine gun, shotgun. The shotgun's gonna be really cool. Um, the whole reason why I've been upgrading the machine gun has been because I'm- I have in my brain I'm going to be able to fight the big bad with it, right? And that seemed to be 0% the case. I'm busy all the freaking time. So we're going to do this instead. Fire rate, more damage, more pellets. More damage, more fire rate. And we're just going to stick to the shotgun. Wow, that's a lot of frags. Look at all that. It's like Christmas. You can either take that from Team Fortress 2's Sniper, or I prefer to take it from Roland from Borderlands. It's like Christmas. What is this? Large one? Okay. I thought that was the last shot I needed on that guy. Okay, large and one. Nope, come on, come on, come on, come on. there we go. This should be a pretty quick mine, right? I need more of the blue stuff and I need more of the white stuff, so this will work out pretty well. I feel. There's our anomaly. Cool, we're done already. Yep, we can just we can just go. I'm gonna grab all this material that's here. I'm gonna grab you, and we're done. We're we're just gonna leave. We're gonna grab any materials that have already been dusted off like this, then we're out of here. That saves so much time. It's almost... I don't know if I like the seismic breaker component on the Spider-Matron, or if I like the this thing better of it telling me where my resources are and where the anomalies are. Oh, I don't know about the resources, but like the anomalies and the size of the mine. It almost feels a little cheaty, but I really like it. I really do. I don't... yeah, I don't know which one I like better. This is the stuff I need badly. And I should have just enough for us to get a couple of mining drill upgrades, yeah? yeah gimme, gimme, gimme. Put that in. Gimme, gimme. Put that in. Okay. Um. What's the next one of this? Shots deal even more damage. Nice. I don't care. I'll take that. Um, then we just have to really save up for the next tier. And that gives us either repulsors or the defocus drill. Uh, shots deal more damage plus 10% fire rate. I can only do one. More damage. More damage, why not? Yeehaw! Yep, uh, already no more anomalies, we're just gonna leave. My main objective with all of this is to find more blueprints, right? If we can agree on that, then there's no point in me sticking around when we've, when we've gotten all the anomalies. Okay, this is gonna suck terribly.
When they reposition, I want to get them, but I don't want to lose all my freaking hull in the process. Hi, blop. This is so dangerous. Oh, there's someone in the way! No, 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 oh my god. Oh my god, why? Why? <laughs> I need... I... I don't know if this is gonna come or whatever. I need claws? I need a claw upgrade or big stompy feet or something? Like, I need... I need a way to just bulldoze through those guys. Because me getting pot shot uh, like crazy like it's happening right now because a little foot soldier's in the way is absolutely unreasonable. That really screws up my battle plan because I'm not looking down there. I'm looking up here trying to deal with all these jinglings. Friggin' ding-dong circus up here. I think I'm gonna get got. But I'm gonna do my best to not get got. Man, I miss my drone. Medium one. Okay, that's fine. The good thing is, every single time I deploy, we're getting more of the nano machine material or whatever, right? I'm not going to be able to hit farts with that thing. I don't know why I'm trying. We still have it one? Oh, I picked it up and then I immediately dropped it. Hello? Okay. I immediately dropped it a second time. I, I'm noticing that sometimes my clicks are dropped when I'm inside the vehicle, which is fine. You just gotta work your way through it, right? It just seems weird. Oh, I didn't check. I think this said one anomaly. There it is. There's our anomaly. We're kinda leaving. Maybe I'm shortchanging some of our ability to stay resilient when we keep relocating over and over and over again, but like, there's no need for me to mess around here. The only thing I'm going to gain is more of the white material, which I need, but I kind of want to... more blueprints, yeah? Turret replicator. Not super interested in any of that, actually. Okay, we got everything? Cool. Uh, I'm gonna do this. So that guy will just keep mining for us, generating that material as we can. Um, let's do this. Let's do that. That improves it by tw uh, an extra 5% for 20%. I like that. I'm gonna have to finish whatever Windows update is doing. Oh, I didn't check for anomalies. I'll check in a second, because we're about to get raided. I'm gonna guess zero, if I had to guess. One, okay. I don't have a grenade launcher, I just realized. So I'm gonna have to actually maneuver around these stupid things. Thank you. I was like, excuse me, sir, if you could get got, that would be amazing. My life expectancy would greatly increase if you could just get got. That would be great.
Yep, and that's what I wanted to do with that. Okay, so our weapon is not going to be able to fight the big bad. That's fine. We got missiles, yo. It's so weird to not have my stake launcher. Hopefully this will give us a little better air control. Maybe? Hoping? Hoping thinking? Uh, I don't actually have any wiggle room at all. That one kerfuffle of a battle completely ruined my entire stratagem. That's okay. We will we will persevere. We got missiles. They ain't got missiles. We'll be fine. Uh, I would contribute with my machine gun, but I've put no research into any of that, so it cannot hit the broadside of a barn if it was made with part of the barn. It's not gonna happen. Oh, is that guy not dead? Cool. Alright, how many anomalies? One? Okay. I guess if I can only take one thing out to the field... I think I like the seismic generator best? There it is. Cool. That was easy. Okay, we're just out of here. Yep. Like, if there's loot on the way out, right? I'm beholden to nobody when it comes to loot. <laughs> if I got teammates, I'll share. Absolutely. I'm a sharing kind of guy, but uh, this is a solo game. So I'm beholden to myself to get the loot? Cool. Drone adds much, much firepower. Good gun. Many long time. <laughs> Trying to speak in some sort of a weird... Proto language. Okay, uh, we go back up. Right? Uh, technically, it doesn't matter because I don't have the materials, the regular blue materials, to do anything. So the specialty materials are going to be bupkis. Who cares? Um, that being said, I'm just gonna, yeah, I'm just gonna go up anyway. Uh, we didn't get any blueprints. Oh, what's this guy? I must have missed this guy in combat. What's up, this guy? You got an anomaly. All anomalies are equal in the eyes of the Adeptus Mechanicus. I interest you in joining the fold. That was fast. That was faster than I would have liked it to have been. <laughs> that was an expeditious. Look at this army of jerks. Yeah, I would not have survived with the machine gun alone. That's for certain. So what lesson did we learn, kids? It's always smart to have options, right? Have it and not need it, then need it and not have it. There's your there's your bit of philosophy for the day. Knowing my level of intelligence and understanding of practicality, it's just a dime store philosophy degree. Don't worry about it. Like, if I consider myself a member of like ancient Grecian society and be like, where would I where would I put myself in all of that? Realistically, like, in the Senate talking about the politics and the methods of understanding and governing so I could better, uh, more adeptly, you know, be a part of the, of the, of the solution and not the problem. That's how I see myself. Unfortunately, where I probably am is getting really drunk with Dionysus. <laughs> you know, you can soak that cheese in vodka. You absolutely can. <laughs> or be Oozel, probably. You know you can soak that cheese in oozle and you're getting you're getting all your nutrients you need and you're getting smashed. Hi. 
John Megacycle. I don't think we've met. Dionysus? Yeah, amazing. How's it going? What you got going on there? Your own kombucha? Amazing. I don't even know what that is, but it sounds amazing. Okay, I don't want to fart around here anymore. So I think because we're leaving early, like I said, we are shorting ourselves some resources. Which again, I don't really think I mind super- uh, another one? Am I dumb? Did I just miss all this? I am pretty tired, so that could be a thing. Alright, one anomaly. But this is all the greens I wanted, so that's at least a good thing. Hey, a friggin' blueprint deer! What we got there? Seismic generator level 2. There you go. That's what we call the good vibrations, right? That's awesome. No, that's that's great. Uh, even if it just increases power, not even potency or time, like frequency, whatever, whatever that's called, uh, that would still be pretty cool if it's just like more powerful kabam bammers. What can I build? Oh, the turrets. Uh... Meh? How close are we to... Nah. If we were closer to the big bad timer, maybe? But uh, it's going to be quite a ways until they even show up, so... Mm, feeling mighty indifferent. I'll take an extended drilling efficiency, thank you. Oh, uh, we didn't get the anomaly, did we? No, we didn't. Okay. Oh, yeah, we did. Yep, it was right there. <laughs> oh, my God. Brains, what even are they? Do you need one? Like, honestly, can you do without? I'm, I think I'm doing without pretty well. Okay, cool. Uh, so the anomaly is built upon the room. That's an important thing to note. Just like with the weapon, the weapon anomaly identifies the room as an anomaly, not necessarily the component tree we pick up, so. So we got our extra mining capability. I think we don't necessarily need to go the path we've gone if, and I'm going to say this if, we get the, what was it, the charging station again? With the plus 100% or 200% mining capability? It's like, tuh. I'm no math magician, but that sounds like pretty tasty numbers. Yeah, I'm thinking this is the ideal strat. Uh, go down one, go up one, go down one, go up one. I don't know how big the wall is or whatever. Um, but that seems like that that's how that would work. I'm really still hoping, honestly, that we're going to get some late game technology that's going to kind of void the necessity of doing that. I never got late game. I have no idea. I don't have any idea how that's going to work. Just got him right in the tush. Excellent. Okay. Uh, I don't have enough materials to do literally anything. I could repair the boat, but... Meh. It sounds like quitter talk or something. I don't know. Where'd the bomb go? Come on, man. You have a mega powerful vacuum. How are you dropping stuff? Intentionally? That sounds about right. Okay, I want you to go right there. Have fun. I'm gonna go the other way. Gonna go my own way. Go my own way. I know it's go your own way, but I'm talking to myself here. Uh, stake launcher? 
Bomb thrower. I should really take a look at that tech stack and see how that would pan out. Like to really gauge viability. Oh, I didn't check how many anomalies there were. Shoot. We already were here and we already bled out some of the resources. So I wouldn't expect this to be crazy. I Oh, did I read that as a small? It feels like a small. It's absolutely 100% a small. Yep, cool. I'll take that. Thanks. Yep, cool. Let's go. One anomaly, one anomaly. Cool. <laughs> Still want to say Amelie. Oh, that's fine. We're just going to Amelie the guy. Uh, yeah. Replacing their shoes with shoes that are one size too small. Uh, tilting all their picture frames slightly to the left, so they're crooked every day or every whatever. Uh, a little annoying crap. That's, that's, yeah, that's pulling an, an Amelie. The funny thing is I didn't think there was another American that has seen French films in general, let alone Amelie, so when I heard that as a reference, I was like, holy crap. Uh... I'm not, like, super into French cinema or anything, but uh, I've seen some German films as well. That's fine. I need captions and subtitles and crap, but whatever. There have been some post-apocalyptic films that I've definitely enjoyed. After you see a couple of films like that, though, it's also... Okay, when I grab from the... the this thing, that falls out. <laughs> That's interesting. Maybe because the vacuum hits it both. Uh, anyway, like, older older films. It's interesting to see, like, what parts of a movie or cinematography... Oh, hey! Look at that. I'm gonna interrupt myself just one more time. Hang on. Second crypto key. Awesome. I kind of forgot that was a game mechanic. Uh, what's interesting to see is how different cultures treat humor. Um... Seeing someone smile, it's a fairly low-level response, you'd be like, oh, they're happy. They're showing some sort of feeling of an emotional response of joy or gratitude or something, right? Uh, but in how that how that imagery is presented and how it's depicted is what makes it unique across the cultures. And it's something that's really a treat. Um, yeah. I don't I don't really want to go too 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 far into detail, but just like little little nuggets like that. It's just like it's always fun to see. Again, I need captions and subtitles. I'm a dum-dum, but... I haven't taken your kind for a while. I haven't seen your kind for a while. Tea? Where are you getting the herbs for tea? Is it campfire-flavored tea? Is it charcoal-flavored tea? <laughs> Is it... what? What's the flavor of the tea? Fire? Is it fire-flavored tea? Mate, <laughs> I'm not trying to... I'm not trying to pee-pee on your hospitality, but... <laughs> With what resources are you doing this? <laughs> Is it wall flavored tea? Okay. Like when you offered an aperitif, I I thought it was alcohol maybe, but no. Just tea? And it's wall flavored. Amazing. Ah yes. Our peoples have grown accustomed to and have perfected the art of making wall flavored tea. The beauty of it is, is every wall tastes different, so it's a unique experience every time. Look at me, I'm selling myself on my own dumb idea. Because it's it's a dumb, silly thing to say. Alright, let's take care of the north, let's take care of the south. Very good. Not very good, because they keep showing up. Oh, I had some... I actually had some money. Um, not enough for what I want, but I had some money. Um, we're gonna crank on two of those. The fast pump would be the only upgrade I have for the shotgun. 200% drilling efficiency. How could I say no to that, honestly? I'm not interested in the stationary turret, and I'm not really interested in the bomb launcher or the grenade, grenade thrower. 
Ganade, the Ganade Thrower. I can talk. There's our anomaly. So I'm just gonna just mass my way through this very, very quickly. Weird disposition like a man on a mission. Poet didn't even know it. Crap like that, yo. Cool, we're done. Actually, a lot of this stuff is very nearby. Uh, overdrive, cool. Alright. Now we're leaving. We are leaving! Okay, there's that anomaly. We're almost able to clear three biomes per before the second big bat, right? That's that's pretty good. Uh, yeah, sell me that bifurcation, baby. Nope, nope. Redeploy, 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 redeploy. Fix it, 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 fix it. Oh yeah, look at this. Look at this. It's beautiful. Uh, I lost the charging station. I don't care. I should go back and get the charging station. I will be going back and getting the charging station. This disposition turned very weird very quickly. <laughs> I refuse. Mm, I'll think about it. Well, I've considered it and I might. Well, now I'm definitely doing it. Look at all this. Oh man. Money, money. Let's hope we survive to tell the tale so we can spend that. Thank you, missile. Yeah, you come up here. Get him. Yeesh. Cool. Just avoided all that damage. Oh my gosh. Excellent sauce. See the background? Like a titan graveyard or something? Come on. There we go. Thanks, friend. Yeah, for whatever reason, the right mouse button seems to get stuck if I try to do too much stuff too quickly. Um, end of the world? No, because I just left click and then that cancels out the action or whatever. The problem is the only memory I honestly have left is muscle memory, right? That's kind of the thing. So if something doesn't work the way I'm expecting it to, or at least that my, my my body's expecting it to, and I'm just clicking and I'm clicking, I'm clicking, I'm on autopilot, I'm not even thinking, right? It's just like, well, this should have worked. It's worked in the past, why is it not working now? And it's like, same thing with tech, right? That's what makes new technology inherently frustrating for older folk. Is uh, they learned how to do something one way, now they gotta relearn how to do it. And that's incredibly frustrating. I'm an old folk. <laughs> I don't appreciate that crap either. Uh, what's the best example I have of that? A oh, resource harvester, nice. That's not my example, but the Microsoft ribbons, the ribbons they added to Office, that whole trend is really frustrating to me. It shouldn't be, but it is. Um, because I took the same approach everyone else did. It worked fine the way it was before. Why the redesign? Why Why did you change where all my stuff was? I knew file, save, as. Easy. Everyone knew that. It's how it's been for 20 years. If not more. You know. And then, of course, that falls under the whole, well, we need a new version so we can keep selling you the same crap over and over again. So we move all the crap around. And then we'll make it, we'll put it behind some BS paywall and be like, well, you have to buy the latest version of No One Gives a Crap. And it's like, well, why? And it's like, well, it's incompatible with the last version of No One Gives a Crap. You know, it's that kind of a BS sales argument. Which is always inherently frustrating and disrespectful for everybody, but... Alright, you hear that noise? That's me getting off my soapbox.
Oh wait, are we going up or are we going down? Crap, I forgot. I get on these weird tangents and then I just forget exactly 100% what I'm doing. Uh, this is up, I think. Hold on, you'll get yours. Um, I honestly forgot. I think we're going down? Well, it didn't freak out. Oh, we're going up. Okay, cool. Uh, have we not seen this biome before? I'm at least going to deploy so we get the drill going on. Oh, this isn't new, new territory, but this is this is where I should be going, I think, yeah. If I can get back to the mine. Okay, 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 okay. Uh, it's almost the same reaction, but not nearly. It's a weird form of panic. Like, I can handle the situation, but it's still panic. It's almost like a text-based RPG where it's like, you see a kitty in a hallway, and they would like you to scratch their chin. You'll scratch your chin. And the text-based RPG comes back and it says, Oh, you've won the affection of the cat. Congratulations. By the way, there's now 500 more cats in the hallway. And you're like, oh, no. I mean, I could probably handle the situation, but oh, no. Yeah, this is this is exactly where we need to be. We're machine gunning through all this. This is great. Uh, I didn't check the anomalies, which I keep forgetting to do because it's new and I'm a silly boy. Come on, 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 come on. There we go. This is great. Twenty-five thousand of the nano material. Awesome. Hey, a blueprint. Yeah, yeah. Force field level 2 can absorb 50% more damage. I am cool with that. I am down to clown. Uh, did we just make like 3,000 more of this stuff in like no time? Amazing. Uh huh. Yep, that's grand. Yeah, I'm just going to keep blasting through this. Resources or not, I'm just going to keep blasting through this. That worked out amazingly. Got a minute 23 before Big Bad number 2 shows up. I wish there was another long-range weapon like the machine gun that wasn't the machine gun. Something with piercing would be cool. Uh, doesn't have to be explosive rounds or explosive munitions, but something like AP. AP rounds would be cool. Armor piercing would be cool. Maybe a nice mix between the shotgun and the machine gun. Maybe a fully automatic flak? Like an anti-aircraft flak cannon? Maybe? Something? I don't know. An auto cannon sounds dope. Like a, a Vulcan machine gun or something? Uh, only real thing about that is it's just a faster machine gun who cares. Like, it's got to be a little different at least, right? I'm gonna move these both over here because I don't really necessarily need them. Um, what else would be cool? A frying pan would be a fun weapon, maybe? Okay. There's that. Okay, that's all the materials I'm going to be able to accrue at this time. So where are we... 
tech wise we've got all the mining capacity i can get we've got all the repair i can get plus 10 percent fire rate on the fast pump shoddy let's do that um turrets do we do some turret stuff plus 20 percent fire rate turret max limit minus cost let's do some of this action oh i forgot about the resource harvester what happened did you build the thing? You did build the thing. Okay, move, move, move. Hey, ah, okay. Or just lose half of our shield. That's fine, too. That stuff really freaking hurts for probably no reason. Uh, I'll be honest, I have not been keeping track on how many missiles are required to win this fight. More than 12, maybe. How about more than, like, 8? More than 8 sounds about right. And I do not like how short range this thing is. Yep, I stand by what I said before. This is very Blaster Master of the Nintendo era. Absolutely. Oh, okay. I can tell you don't like my personality. Not big surprise. Not many people do. I'm sure every friend group has a guy who doesn't shut up who thinks he's funny personality, and I definitely have that. A lot of duplicates in this table, I'm telling you. Nope, get no okay. Uh <laughs> I don't I no, I don't want to. Get up, get up, okay. Alright. Time to spend all my resources keeping my boat that's on fire not on fire. Uh, have we broken a single bulb? I think we have. I like how those little flies can throw a projectile that's literally twice their body size. That's it. That's all the repairs I got. The thing is, I'm so zoomed out, I can't actually tell where my gun is pointing. I know where my reticle is pointing, but I don't know if my gun is moved to that location yet, so it's a little awkward. Yeah, now what? Did we win? Uh... The music changed, and then it freaked out. Uh, we're still in combat, though. Holy crap, we beat the second big bad! <gasps> and it almost killed me. That took half my shield. Cool. <coughs> oh my god. Alright, um... We got the anomaly out of here. We're leaving. We are leaving! I don't have any repair materials. Can I repair my Spider-Tron with an anecdote and a can full of farts? If I can, we're actually in a pretty good position. And I hit the wrong button because I did. One, okay. Ah, yes, I require repairs to my mechanoid. Do you accept metaphors and very loosely thought together patterns of logic? If you do... Excellent. No, I don't have, like, money or anything. Come on. One anomaly. Where are you at? 
Yeah, you see how quickly we're just machine gunning through this? This is incredible. Uh, I might ride or die this mine. Meaning, just go until we're dead. Not, don't come back to the Spider-Tron. Okay, that locks. Yeah, I didn't think that bled through. Hey, another blueprint. Awesome, and I can still make it back to lose. Combat capacitor zaps the enemies with burst electricity, making them shock each other. That's dope as hell. Yeah, let's give it a go. I keep forgetting I have overdrive. Uh, that was the only anomaly. We are leaving. This is the longest run we've had. We've beaten the second big bad just using missiles. It kind of doesn't add a lot of... Oh, we're gonna get hosed. Oh, we're gonna get hosed, Tommy. Um... I like the missiles as a weapon. They're a nice auxiliary weapon frame. The only problem I have with it is it makes it very boring that it's the only way I can fight the big bad with the current weapons I have. That being said, maybe we find some better weapons. I'm not going to make it. I, I need to charge in and thin this out. Holy crap. Holy crap. We made it. I didn't think it was going to happen. It happened. I like being proved wrong. <laughs> Holy cow. Oh, I didn't check the anomalies. Ah, oh, come on. Like, it's such a game changer. I don't know why I keep forgetting it. Maybe because we've been playing the game long enough that we didn't have it. And now that we have it, it just feels weird. Oh, okay. I don't like that layout. <laughs> These are the materials I need to progress up the tech tree, though, so even if we don't find an anomaly... Uh, still worth the effort, for sure, 100%. Okay, what do we have now? We have another option for repairs. That's a good thing. 110? Oh my gosh. Okay, we're going to do some repairs. Okay, are there any anomalies here? There are two anomalies, actually. Okay. Um... Yeah, alright. Let's see what this brings. No, I don't see anything. I have no idea what we're shooting at. The shotgun does do some shredding, for sure. For sure, for sure. That's great. Okay, are there any other upgrades we can get for the docking station? Yes, there is. 150% more? That's... I love it, but that seems really broken and wrong.
Right, okay, we've already been to some of this. Two anomalies, huh? I mean, I'm taking your word on it. I'm just not seeing it quite yet. Seeing is believing and all that, right? Okay, I need one of you to come with me. Oh, there's a whole other area over here. Cool, alright. God, when you said large, you were not joking in the slightest. Come on, there we go. And dump, and dump, and awesome. Now that was a haul. How much did that set us at? 109. 109 is going to give me... What exactly? Oh, uh, something actually for the drone. Plus five shots in a burst? Or... Because I can't afford both. I'm off by one monies. Plus 45% damage. That's the true. That is the way. Oh, uh... Resource harvesters, I guess? I should have built these long, long time ago, but I was not paying attention. We still haven't gotten all the anomalies out of this thing. We haven't gotten any anomalies, I don't think. Uh, movement speed around the docking station? Nope, I need greens. Frickin' boo, man. Boo. There's one anomaly. I very much would like to find the other one. Even if it's a weapon, I might not pick it up, but I still want to know what it is. Like, th if it is a weapon or not. It's... no? Oh, okay, I thought it was going to be a weapon right there. Uh, alright. I'm genuinely confused about the layout now. Forty four thousand. Oh, and it's a weapon. I just want to know for sure that it is a weapon and not another crypto key. It is another weapon. Don't care. I got to get back. There's so many. And there's the other anomaly. So now we got to make a decision as to whether or not we come back for the rest of the booty. Excuse me. That snuck up on me. Make it back just in time. A barrage mortar? At the beginning of each fight, scatter several plasma mines across the wall. The mines explode when enemies approach. That's dope as hell. Too bad combat's already begun. Wow, that dude took a lot of shells. Well, that dude got a face full of missile. Um, alright. We're just gonna move on. I know there's resources back there, and I know I'm cutting myself short a little bit, but I don't care. I'm all about that anomaly game, baby. 
One anomaly. Okay, let's go ahead and see if there's anything else we can buy. And I, I'm betting the answer is just a straight up no. Um, I can buy repairs. Quite a bit of repairs, actually. Forty-seven thousand. Freaking incredible. Hey, and another blueprint. Combat capacitor level two. Nice. More damage. Increased frequency of discharge. I, yeah. We don't. We haven't even tried the level one yet. I'm already excited about the level two. Um, let's see if we can. Fi okay, this layout looks very familiar. I'm not interested. Let's see if we can find that second anomaly, which I'm going to guess is... something? <laughs> oh hey, Resource Harvester's doing work. Oh, I forgot to buy one! Right, right, right. Uh, I don't see the other anomaly yet. Is that the landmines being dropped? It is a few, few, few. That's a, that's a cool noise. I have nothing else to add other than that is a really cool noise. All right. Um, we got a blueprint from here. We've not gotten the other anomaly. I'm going to abandon it, and we are going to move on. I. Highly doubt they would give us two blueprints in the same mine. I mean, I don't, I don't know, but I'm going to just make some assumptions here. For the sake of sanity, and I've only got nine minutes until Big Bad Number Three shows up. I don't even know what that fight's gonna entail. Do we just, do we just get instagot? Because I have not been upgrading my weapon ser uh, series. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know what endgame tech we're going to need to fight that guy. I wish the drone would be good enough to just handle this. Let's see. You know what? Let's try it. Let's try it. Let's see if that's a thing. How many anomalies first? One on a medium. Okay. Cool. The drone is successful in rebuking the enemy. Hey, another one. Is that the fourth one? Third, third one. Induction amplifier increases movement speed in the mine and drilling efficiency in a small area around the spider. Induction amplifier. The other one's an induction capacitor? What's the other one called? I wonder if it acts like a, a big version of that little guy. Yeah, come on guys. Let's get out of here. We're already done. The mine is clear. That that saves so much time. It's ridiculous. So we're going to have Actually, I think that's our fourth blueprint. We're going to have better shields. We're going to have this combat capacitor. We're going to have a lot of good stuff. And 55,000 money bucks. Any upgrades I can get? We've got the best... No, never mind. I was going to say we have the best drill available. That's a lie. Um, because of the material types we have available, I'm unable to progress on fundamentally every single level, which is unfortunate. 
Um, I would like another turret replicator. We're getting kind of far in the tech in the tech tier here. Chat log report. Well, I don't know how to say it. Well, I'm on the surface. Let me digest that. I probably shouldn't say this, but all this open space, it's scary. Like, scary as hell. It feels like you're falling. Makes sense. I could see how that would feel. Yeah, see, this is why I don't really care for the turrets, because I just built the damn thing. And now I'm just gonna leave it, right? Like, big deal. I'm just going to keep going up. I'm not doubling back. I only have six minutes to the next big bad, and I'm very confident I'm not going to win that fight. I don't... I think I barely won the second big bad fight. Okay, I'm probably not going to win this fight either. Okay. really wanted to get that big bulbous jerk. Hopefully some chain reaction action. Why is it zooming weird? Why why is it zoomed out this far? Uh there's something that's going to happen. The camera has betrayed. What is this thing? Is this the big bad? What is this thing? What is that thing? What is all this? Okay. I have two crypto keys? Is that what's... You want a piece of this? What's going on? Oh! Oh. Okay. Uh, all right. <laughs> Not too sure how to emotionally handle that. <laughs> Why so happy, Ben? Can you imagine I found another. I also found a crypto key. Shut up. Yeah, here, look. How'd you do that? It's been generations since we unearthed one. You just need to know where to dig. Okay. How about try not be too full of yourself? Okay. <laughs> Maybe it's too late for that. <laughs> Why so pensive? Oh, I think I found a core. Right. Have you noticed any unseen guardians nearby? How could I see an unseen guardian? What? I'm not joking. It, just, it looks it looks just like our core, but inactive. All right, all right. I believe you. Just don't tell the others. Let this be our tiny little secret. Okay, so... We need five crypto keys. That little console, two of them lit green. I have two keys. So I'm going to guess that's our gate, right? We need five keys in order to progress. Maybe the core helps us with the third big bad because that seemed pretty ultimate that I was going to get got. Anyway, uh, we got a seismic generator. 20% faster cooldown, double the damage, double the distance. I, yeah. Force field, 50% more damage absorption. Yeah. Induction amplifier, increases movement speed in the mine and drilling efficiency in a small area around the spider. Hell yeah. Combat Capacitor. Zaps enemies with electricity. And we got two levels of that too. We got a lot of upgrades. We also have 30, 31,000? Um, better missile to help us fight the second big bad. It gives us the Leviathan. Which is the final tier of missile. Nice. Uh, 10,000 monies doesn't get us very far. I have not tried the hook. I've not tried the turbines. I've kind of felt there's more emphasis on other stuff. So, meh. Anyway, that was a bit of a long one. Thanks for sticking with me. My name's John Megacycle. Another episode of Wall World is in the books, and I hope to catch you next time. Hey there, guys, gals, fans, and pals. Thanks for checking out my video. I also want to take a moment to thank all my supporters and donators, and if you'd like to join up with me and Game With My Crew, all the information to get connected is in the description below. 
Thanks again, and I hope to catch you next time.